With nothing but the clothes on their backs and 300 miles from home, 35 members of a Georgia youth group were thankful to walk to safety, even if it's without their shoes. It was a miracle that we all got out. That's really all it was. Just after 5 a.m., a kitchen fire forced them out of their temporary home at the First Baptist Church Recreation Center downtown. Jeremy Newell heard the first snap, crackle, and pop of the flames and jumped into action. It's just amazing um, that I guess that I woke up. And he stood up and looked through and saw a fire in the kitchen. He immediately responded, got all the guys up and out of the, the gym area, and then came upstairs to where the rest of us were and uh, turned on the lights and got us all out. I'm, I'm very thankful um, that we all got out safe. The group from the Bethany Baptist Church in McDonough, Georgia, spent the week helping the Nashville Rescue Mission. Uh, working to help them just get some things organized in their basement, prep for meals, and also to get ready for their, uh, their big Easter uh, uh, banquet. But now they were the ones in need, having to leave all their belongings behind in what became a building filled with smoke. I'm actually wearing all, all their clothes. Leaving the First Baptist Church to step in and provide for those who came to help others. They also have, a, I think, a clothes closet here or something that they're trying to find some clothes for the, for the kids and adults, um, for shoes and just jackets and stuff to get us by. To get them by until they can make reassuring phone calls home. I was like, um... Well, there was a fire at the church, and she was like, is everyone out okay? Make sure everyone's okay. I was like, yeah, everyone's okay. A little bit of smoke in our eyes, but uh, other than that, no issues at all. Making today a very good Friday. Justin McFarland, Fox 17 News.